So, 3WA, ETU 600. One of the features we get as standard in the ETU 600 is DAS plus mode. So that's dynamic arc flash sentry. Now it's a concept that's been around for a number of years in UL applications, but as I said on the Siemens IEC portfolio, it is available integrated as standard. So what exactly is it? It's a way of reducing the risk of arc flash fault energy to the engineers that are working in close proximity to the panel. So it works off its own set of protection parameters. So it runs a reduced trip threshold. So when you're in DAS plus mode, you're tripping at a lower threshold and without time delays at the same time, thus giving you that enhanced protection for the engineers. So there's a couple of ways of activating DAS plus mode. We can do it locally on the push buttons on the ETU here. So if I press function key two, press OK, I've now activated DAS plus mode. Likewise, I can deactivate it the same way. However, this sort of defeats the object in some situations. You're already in front of the panel, you're already at risk. So you can also activate DAS plus mode through communication options, such as Siemens Power Config software. And I've connected via Bluetooth onto the device here. So if I simply set DAS plus mode through Power Config, we're now online. Now, note that DAS plus mode is safety interlocked. The method that I turn it on by, I must also turn it off by. We don't want an engineer going up to the panel, activating DAS plus mode, and then another engineer back in the control room turns it off remotely. That defeats the object of the safety. So, I must reset it via power config. Thanks for watching.